Hi, and welcome back. Today I'm going to give you my third update on my finished four by the 4th of July. I am halfway done, sort of, I guess you could say. I have two empties. Um, this one I used up like almost within the first few weeks of this project, and this was the Neutrogena Oil-Free Moisture Sunscreen. I don't like it, don't recommend it. It's done. The second item I have used up is my ColourPop Tassel Super Shock Shadow, and this one was white. I don't know, you probably won't be able to see. Um, I wound up using this in my hair because the white just did not look good. On my eyes, it was pretty stark and ridiculously, like, oh, chunky, glittery. Um, so I'll just put it in my hair and make my hair shiny. Somebody had suggested that I do that, and so I started doing that, and that shadow is gone. Not my favorite ColourPop shadow, and that was Tassel, the white one. So that one's done. And my Orly Nail Polish in Explosion of Fun. I had started up here, second update was right here, or first update, or second update, I don't know. I think this was my second and my first update line, and I wound up using it all up. There's nothing left that I can get out of this bottle, and it's really thick. Um, but it's practically gone. Fun thing though, I have another bottle of this. I'm not going to break it out yet because I love this nail polish, but I need a little bit of a break from it. So I have three items down. This one it doesn't have a whole lot of progress. This is Urban Decay's Heavy Metal Eyeliner, Liquid Eyeliner in the color Spandex, and there's like this weird air bubble in it. Can you see that? Let me see. Yeah, so right here. And that little like ooh, little air bubble. I should have put this on today, but I thought that might be a little bit of overkill. So I'm slowly working through this. I don't expect this to be gone in the month. Um, it's sort of it's one of those items where you have to be wearing the right everything for this to look good. But this was just a fun fun item for me to put in because I had this themed, all of the glitter stuff was like firecrackers for the 4th of July. Or fireworks. Firecrackers? No, fireworks for the 4th of July. And then my other, t my, uh, so technically all of my stuff is done, but I wound up adding in two eyeliners just for the heck. I have two like bonus items and those are two eyeliners that I just wanted to see moved out by July. And the first one is Max Industrial Eyeliner, which I'm wearing all over my lid today underneath um, Stars and Rockets and MAC Nylon. This was my start and I used a tiny bit since May 5th. This is my favorite eyeliner in the entire world. I have already purchased a second one of this because this one's dying which is why I put it in this project just to move it on out it's really really hard though it's not creamy anymore is what I should be saying and then my other eyeliner is Urban Decay's Crave and this one I've had a ton of progress on as you can see within the last month a ton of progress on this one because this is a good um, waterline eyeliner for me. So this one's almost done. I don't foresee having either of these left by the end of this project. That's my goals anyways. So three out of one, two, three, four, six items. So our project's half done. These two will be gone by the next update. This is sort of like a give me project. Um, I really like it though and I like that I put a whole ton of glitter items in here. Yeah. So anyway, so thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the 4th of July around that time for my finale on that. It shouldn't be too overly exciting though because I have high hopes for this one. Anyways, have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you later. Bye. Let's get into it. Um, real quick, I... Mm, yeah, three out of six. Whoa! I can't count or add or subtract, can I? 
Um, the second item 